And just at that moment, coincidentally, this homeless dude out of nowhere pulls his dick out. Started beating off. You know what? Now that I actually think about that, that's really not even... It's kind of hot, you know? Like, just thinking about that the second time over, you know, it's kind of a homeless man on, on the train no clothes on? Kind of train. Sorry, you know I had to do that. You know that had to be the video, obviously. Now let's get into the rest of the actual video. What's up, guys? I swear this isn't a herpy bump. I swear it isn't. I swear it has nothing to do with the homeless man that's in this video giving me the herpy bump. I swear. <laughs> so on the last Try to Laugh video, we watched some female comedians that made me start to think that eating cat turds out of a cat litter box is probably more fun of an activity. Needless to say, the female comedians didn't really, didn't really make me chuckle, didn't make me go ha ha ha, didn't make me laugh. And that's the whole point of this series on my channel, is watching things and doing things or whatever it may be, just to make me laugh. Hence the name Try to Laugh. And today we're going to be diving into the well-known side of comedy, the side that's actually known for being funny and making people laugh, the male side of comedians. Taking the shades off here, and we're going to watch the first clip here. And we're going to start out with Dave Chappelle, which is an absolute legend in the stand-up comedian world. So I figured why not start out with him. Let's just cue it up here, and we're going to start. Just at that moment, Coincidentally, this homeless dude out of nowhere pulls his dick out. Started beating off. And then he started walking up and down the aisles. He was terrorizing us. <sighs> nice reaction here, Pokemon. You want a salad to go with those bad entertainment skills? He screamed out, rush him! He can't come on all of us and charge him out. <laughs> and it was like a movie. This homeless dude seen him coming. And shot went off. Ah! <laughs> I dodged that shit like the Matrix, niggas. Oh, oh. Pretty solid start for Dave Chappelle here. He's made me, almost made me chuckle a little bit. I'm smiling a tad bit, but it's starting to work on me. Obviously, unless you've been under a rock for the past, like, I don't know, whenever stand-up comedy was invented, like, back in... You would know that male comedians tend to make people laugh almost always unlike their female counterparts. So I'm not very surprised that Dave Chappelle is already making me smile a little bit. But I just wanted to stop there and intervene for a second and say, I really don't blame this homeless man for jacking off on the, the train. I mean, that's basically his home, you know? He may have thought he was alone on there. But then again, maybe he just saw a double-cheeked up rat that was in the corner looking pretty thick and had to go, go sicko mode right there, right then, on the train. Which, you can't really blame a man for, for busting a nut in the train, man. I mean, where else does he have to do it at? But now that I think about it, the homeless man had to have some pretty big balls. The guy behind me wasn't so lucky, yo. No! Oof. Flowed right to the face. <laughs> that shit was gross. It didn't kill him, but it was... I'm sure that fucked his day up. I wonder what the homeless guy's load tastes like. You think it tastes like a cardboard box or more like a... More like a garbagey smell, like a haven't showered in a couple years smell. I, let me know what you think it smells like, but I personally think it smells and tastes exactly like a cardboard box that's been out in the garbage a couple weeks and soaked up all the juices from the gar the garbage can. Oh my god, I want to taste it so bad. Oh, let me taste it. That's just my personal opinion. Let's get on with the rest of this. Everyone's standing around looking at them. Even the homeless dude felt bad. I guess he was finished, he came back to his senses. <sighs> oh, this is my stuff. I said, relax, motherfucker. I had to say something. Relax! Oh, I can't. I got AIDS. I know it. I said, you can't get AIDS from a homeless dude busting a knot on your forehead. That's not how it spreads. <laughs> I don't even know if that's just true. That's just what I told him, man. The, he was so scared, I had to say something. I don't know where AIDS comes from. Who the fuck knows? Scientists don't even know. Scientists still say AIDS started because somebody had sex with a monkey. That is true. Word. That's what they say. <laughs> it's actually recently been confirmed that the first person to ever contract AIDS actually got it from watching a JStation 3 AM video on YouTube. After all this research, this is the best explanation that you came up with, mother- Nobody fucks monkeys and people, you idiot! You either fuck monkeys- you got a point. Or you fuck people. That's it. There's no in-between. You're not gonna get some monkey pussy on Tuesday and then be like, oh, let me call Charlene on Thursday. No! Once you fuck a monkey, that's a firm decision. I'm out of the 
human pussy game for good. Ooh, that's a tough decision. I'm gonna have to go with the monkeys, though. Monkey vagina got me feeling wonky, you know what I'm saying, boys? Hey, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, boys? <laughs> go on, Dave Chappelle. I'm sorry for interrupting again. It's ridiculous. You act like monkeys are just as open as waiting for people to fuck them, man. It's but then the monkeys don't want to be fucked by people. Think about it. Think how hard it would be to catch a monkey and fuck it. That's ridiculous. That's, that's how it had to go down. Who do you think you're just going to walk up to him in the woods and bribe this nigga with uh, fruits and bananas? Hey, buddy. Hey. So close to laughing there. I'll... Yeah. There you go. I'll let out a little. Yeah. yeah. There you go, your big bright red ass. <laughs> <laughs> monkey butts always make me laugh. I gotta, I gotta admit that monkey butts always get. I'm gonna let him finish out here, but I already laughed, so technically we already lost, and the video is over. But I'm gonna finish out these little ten. It's like ten seconds left. Dude. I'm just gonna finish it out. You know how strong a monkey is. Would rip your dick off like the celery stalk. <laughs> I already Don't laughed. The floodgates are open. They'll never be seen again. <laughs> the hey, dog, we gonna go to the club, pick up some girls. You trying to roll? Nah, man, I'm cool. <laughs> I'm gonna stay home, dog. Chill with my monkey. <laughs> you know how long it took me to train this monkey to suck my dick <laughs> without peeling it? Mm. Like a banana. <laughs> Last night, Chim Chim jerked me off with his feet. And like, only a monkey can show you that kind of love and tenderness. So y'all can keep fucking these people if you want, niggas. Mo monkey pussy for me. Hooking up with an orangutan next week. That's all I fuck is chimps and orangutans. I had a feeling I would laugh from that, but <laughs> now that I think about it. Talk, someone talking about having sex with monkeys is pretty hilarious. Especially when it's Dave Chappelle. I mean, you can't get much better than Dave Chappelle when it comes to stand-up. But yeah, that's the second try to laugh video, male comedian edition. Male comedian obviously way funnier than female comedians. They talk about some stuff you can actually laugh at and not take too serious. In conclusion, women no funny.